Uniforms Unlimited, a Salisbury business, specializes in embroidery. But in 2012, more than clothes went out their doors. Store owners noticed money was missing, and 12-year employee Crystal Godwin had been stealing from her employers. We treated her and her family like family, and we trusted her. And to break that trust, it was unbelievable. Store owner Annette DeShiel says she and her husband installed cameras to see if Godwin had been stealing. Over 37 days, she reportedly pocketed $5,000 cash. They never, ever expected that this person would have ever done this to them. State's attorney Matt Mazzarello says it's an insidious crime more common in a tough economy. It's almost like a termite eating away uh, at the business from the inside. And by the time you realize you've had that termite, there, you know, it's time for bankruptcy. Mazzarello says it takes an employee who is motivated, willing, and able to steal. And according to investigators, this crime could be stopped by giving multiple employees responsibilities for bookkeeping and being diligent. Keep the safeguards in place, check the books, and don't just say you're checking the books, check the books. If, if, if for some reason the credit card payment looks like it's odd, ask the questions, find out what it was used for. Cody Leibowitz, On the Lookout.